well as making obviously superb and well-appointed campers, Wild Boar have always been about encouraging a warm and welcoming after sales, cultural and community spirit for all those who decide to part with the hard-earned cash and buy one. The Tough Grunt Elite 2019 you see behind me continues and builds on that tradition. The Tough Grunt Elite will get you uphill, through creek or down dale no bother, courtesy of an impressive underbody off-road setup, including, among a host of features, independent suspension and Dobinson's twin nitro shocks. Outside under the awning, you've got a 75 litre dual zone fridge included as standard and a slide out three burner cement kitchen that folds back flat, offering more room, essential for comfortable camping. As well as looking good outside, thanks to custom paint options, inside the Tough Grunt Elite is well designed, comfortable and roomy with the capacity to sleep six hefty adults, including queen-size memory foam mattress up front. There's ample storage throughout, full inner drive battery management system, 40 amp DC-DC, three AGM batteries, hot water system, TV and aerial as standard, and I'm still not done. It's packed with features. Let's see what the judges have to say. The Wild Boar Tough Grunt Elite certainly looked a business. Was this latest in the Tough Grunt series as good as it looked, Ron? Well, I mean, I've, certainly it was very impressive to look at. The appearance of it, the finish of it was excellent. 300 amp batteries in that one as well, so good power storage. On that living off the grid uh, capability, yeah. it's a 100 litre water tank up the front, 50 litre down the back. So, you know, you've got good water supply as well and uh, just adds to that capability of getting away from it all. The other thing I like to pick up on too about the water is the water purification system yeah. on board. And I think that's a nice touch um, in this day and age. Big annex and livability area, how do you find it to live in? Mm, really comfortable actually. I actually really liked the versatility inside as well with the back of the couch that sat back up and you could still have the second bed set up out the rear. Was the usability impressive, Ellie? I thought so, yeah. You still had your underseat storage. They had soft closed drawers under the main bed as well, so there's a bit of extra storage in there. Um, and just the fact that you could really fit a whole family in there. That's good. And this is a six berth camper too, so it's family friendly. You can have three or four kids out yeah. the back or bring your mother-in-law if you want or whatever. <laughs> there's the, the little two metre uh, awning package as well as the big heavier canvas 2.4 metre wide awning. They put a lot of attention into detail and they're the, all the successful campers. That's what you see today, it's that attention to detail. Good inverter, a whole BMS system, fusion sound system, everything you really needed in, a, in an electronic uh, electrical package. So. It was a good thing to see. The ice maker that came as standard was quite a nice touch and definitely something we hadn't seen in any of the other campers we looked at. All the little extras, you got the little hanging hooks along the back so you could have all your, your cooking utensils hanging there over the kitchen. A little nice neat little drawers when the, the kitchen swung around, there's a, a prep bench that you can pull out there, there's a drawer for cutlery and crockery. You even got some of your cooking utensils with it, you got a choice of knife blocks and they, they really think it through and, and uh, give you a lot of options. This year he's actually increased the trailer width by 100, 100 mil. mil. He's made a bigger pantry, he's changed the pole storage. The other thing I'd like to pick up on the body is the removable door. A lot of the doors, you know, they blow shut in the wind or rattle around in the wind or whatever, and I just think, you know, you just pick it up and get rid of it, basically. I've got full confidence in that trailer, and I've personally had a lot of experience with it as well. I've tested a number of wild boar products. Dobinson's shockers on it as well, so locally access sort of componentry in there. And then of course there's the warranty, which is as good as you're going to get. Five year structure warranty, three years on the suspension, a year on everything else, you know, the sort of the, the SMEV cookers and all those sorts of things. At 31,900, there's a lot of camper here for that money. Had a lot of sensible camper there for that money. So the Wild Boar Tough Grunt Elite, usable, good looking, family friendly, certainly a feature packed unit for all sorts of camping trips. <music>